Hi, I'm Richard Pauley, and uh, I'm a nurse, and I am underemployed right now, but I uh, have uh, full-time employment on the way. It's just a matter of waiting, and I've been waiting a month now, and uh, this is my... Uh, this is my home right now. It's a small RV. It's a Chinook camper, and uh, it just really works out for me. I've learned a lot about what I can do without and what I really need. Uh, I have dubbed her the Millennium Falcon, and uh, she has she is the fastest hunk of junk in the RV camping world at this point. But uh, I just want to say that uh, uh, I have really made a lot of friends. Uh, across the community here and a lot of people have really been so wonderful to me. I've made some great friends and I hope that we can all look at each other as an extended family, um, that our church families can extend themselves to each other and out into the community now and really shine, that we can prepare uh, together in faith and wisdom for what looks to be a pretty tough economic time. I uh, try to help others, not a handout, not a give up, not a pity, not uh, uh, some sort of, you know, super liberal giveaway program, but really a person to person helping hand when we see that it can mean something in somebody's life. Um, and people have done that for me. My friends cook me a meal now and then and have offered to let me stay there, but I won't do that. Uh, I'm actually um, learning a great deal uh, by living the lifestyle I'm living now and I can assure you that uh, after I'm working full time again I will be much more um, stringent with my budget number one and uh, I will be in a position I hope to give back to the community and to help some people get on their feet. I, I want to tell everyone that uh, just take each other's hands and help each other out and don't be afraid of each other. Don't panic. Uh, it's okay. I can adapt and live like this. And it's really the families with the little children out there that uh, if anybody's going to panic, they're the ones that are in the tough spot. So I hope that uh, single dads or guys like me with the grown kids that we can reach out to these little families, uh, disabled people, anyone that's down and out. Uh, and do what we can for them. Um, I think it would mean a lot to them right now, and I think it's going to be our way out economically to uh, be entrepreneurs and finding ways to help the community right now. I think that's the light at the end of the tunnel.